Hello, Reading community. We hope that you've had a great week. In this week's video, we have two updates and two shout outs to share. Starting first update uh, is around my entry plan into the district. As the community knows, I committed to a structured entry process to guide my transition into the district as the new superintendent back in July. Now through this process, I met with a variety of different stakeholders to learn about the different strengths, challenges, and opportunities facing our community. I shared out the findings from my entry process at the February 17th school committee meeting and in this week's newsletter, uh, you will find the written document that goes along with this presentation that again, in writing, outlines what I found through this entry process, specifically in terms of strengths, challenges, and opportunities facing the district. This document will serve as the foundation of the process ahead to revise our district strategic plan. So given the importance of this document, I'll really appreciate the community to share any questions, concerns, thoughts, or feedback as we, again, we, we start to use this document to move into our strategic planning. And I'd like to give a special thank you to all of those who have taken time over the past 10 months to meet with me, uh, either individually or, you know, or in group, to share your perspective on our district and your hopes for where we can go in the future. Second update around Arts Fest. Last week in the up video, we took a bit of time to share uh, what was going to take place in this year's Arts Fest. Just want to remind the community that this Tuesday and Wednesday evening at RMHS is our annual Arts Fest. Should be an awesome time for all of our, our community. So please come on down and join in all the different things happening on Tuesday and Wednesday. Now shifting into shout outs, our first shout out, uh, shout out is around a author visit. So you'll see here some photos. The author of our March book of the month, 100 Trillion Stars, saw a tweet from our STEM curriculum coordinator, Heather Leonard, about the book and reached out to volunteer to meet with our students. 40 classes across the district joined author Seth Fishman all at once for a read aloud of his book and a chance to ask the author many different questions, including an estimation challenge. And a special shout out to Connor from Barrows in Ms. Penna's class, who won a signed copy of the book by winning this uh, estimation challenge. So again, here's some pictures and tweets from the visit. I'd like to give a thank you to author Seth Fishman and also to the 40 classes who participated. And to close with our last shout out, I'd like to give a special shout out to all the paraprofessionals across our RPS district. Uh, as you may know, this past Wednesday was uh, National Paraprofessionals Day. Uh, I think here in Reading, we all agree that the, our paraprofessionals are really the glue that hold our schools together. Uh, paraprofessionals who deeply care about our students, invest so much time, energy, and love uh, into caring for our students. So I uh, would just like to thank all the paraprofessionals for their commitment and service to our students. And if you see one of our amazing paraprofessionals, please be sure to, take, uh, to thank them for all that they do for our district. We hope that you had a great week and have a great weekend. Go Rockets!